the last month, if you've been paying any attention, you'll notice that there are two meta stories that are pretty much preoccupying the media. Those two stories are the World Cup and LeBron James. Now the World Cup, which never really mattered in the United States before, is interesting because it has become important in the United States. Not just because the United States team was in it, I think because the World Cup actually has drama, real life human drama. The French team melted down, the Italians got beat, Brazil got beat, Maradona and the Argentinians, the, um, the England squad with all of their problems. A lot of drama, a lot of drama, a lot of drama. Fascinating, plus terrific uh, real competition on the pitch, as they say. The second story, I think, is even more fascinating, and that's the LeBron James story. Where will LeBron go? LeBron James is a free agent. Basketball player, as you know, plays for the Cleveland Cavaliers, grew up in Akron, Ohio, now has a chance to go to any team, and there are a lot of crazy financial things involved in this, but the, the preoccupation with the LeBron James story is the thing that interests me more than anything. Why are we so preoccupied with the LeBron story? I think the reason is we can... Look at the LeBron James story and we can frame it up in terms of three big themes. And the themes are money, winning, and loyalty. Now, which of those three themes will LeBron use to guide his decision? Oh, you hear all kinds of theories from people about which of those it's going to be? Oh, LeBron wants to go where he can win, and that's it's all about winning. No, it's where he's going to be able to make the most money. If he goes to New York, he's going to be a billionaire. No, it's going to be loyalty. He's going to stay home in Cleveland because he grew up in Akron, and he's a loyal guy. And So we all can project ourselves into the LeBron story and use one of those three themes to write the story. And we love to write stories. It's what we do. So tonight, of course, LeBron, in a perfect bit of showmanship, will be announcing his decision tonight at 9 p.m. on ESPN in a live national press conference, just like Obama, right? So, um, and if you go on Twitter, you can ask LeBron questions about his decision. Just hashtag it, LeBron Decision. It's a perfect intermingling of individual storytelling psychology and media memes that I think is uh, unprecedented, really. So um, we'll all be watching tonight at 9 to see where will LeBron go. And even more importantly, 